Hey Libra, how are you? I hope everybody's doing well. I hope that wherever you're at in the world, you're all having the most wonderful day so far. Okay, Libra, this is going to be your weekly reading for the end of March, being March 29th through April 4th. We're going to be looking into how you feel about your person, how they feel about you, the connection between the two of you. And I will be clarifying each card so energies can change as I clarify. Now, this is general, so it may not resonate with everyone. If it does, go ahead and hit the like button below. If you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe to my channel as it helps me pick up on your energy for all future reads, all right? Roles can be reversed. Sorry. Time is fluid. <laughs> so this will be something that happened in your past, currently in your present, or coming up in your future. Roles can be reversed, so take what applies to you, your person, your situation, and leave the rest. I was in a deep thought right there. <laughs> Okay, if this does not resonate, that's okay. Check back on the next reading as I do post them weekly and see if that fits your situation better. I will be pulling an oracle card from Spirit of the Animals Oracle deck at the end of your reading, okay? Now, how does Libra feel about their person? How does Libra feel about their person? So you wanted to build a legacy with this person, but it looks like you reached a turning point and you kind of changed your mind and now you're just wanting to focus on you and remain single and work on your money, your independence. How does Libra's person feel about them? Show me the connection between the two. Oh, you have love for each other. But you definitely have your guard up towards each other. Y'all are possibly spying on each other. Trying to find out find I can't even get my words out. Trying to find out more information on each other. Um, walking away from each other. Maybe working on self-love. Having to leave a situation. Okay, let's see. For them, how they feel about you, we have the devil, we have the empress, and we have the seven of pentacles. So they definitely think about you a lot. They want to be with you. They want to have a family with you. They think that you're everything they've ever wanted. They're trying to be patient with you. Maybe you're trying to focus on you and figure out what you want. Um, but this person cannot stop thinking about you, Libra. I even get this sense that this person felt that... Um, they're stuck to you now that this was uh, toxic between the two of you and they thought they wanted or they do I'm just getting that this person is just obsessed honestly I'm not even gonna try and make that fit so I just get that this person's obsessively thinking about how you two could be together they think you're very good looking. They think you're very abundant, um, sexy. And they're trying to learn patience. Like they're trying to figure out, like they're waiting, waiting on you or waiting for the right time to tell you how they feel. But for the connection, I mean,
there's love there, but having your guard up and deciding just to walk away for the two of you. Clarify Ten of Pentacles. Okay. Okay, keep going. All right. Did y'all let your family get involved and ruin this? Hmm. I feel that you wanted, okay, for the Ten of Pentacles, you get the King of Cups, you have the Five of Swords, and you have the Page of Pentacles. Um, you wanted a family with this person. You have a lot of love for them. However, you feel this person plays games and you find it very immature. It's like, no, nah, I want something. You're learning that this person isn't as serious as you, as you are. Clarify, yeah. Who left who? Get the five of pentacles at the bottom. Maybe this person isn't financially ready. Like you have money and they don't. Clarify um, the wheel of fortune. I feel like you try to, you know, talk to them about, hey, I, I want to, let's move in together, you know, or whatever. And this person wasn't financially ready. Ooh, this is a lot of karma right here. This person played you. They told, okay, this person acted like you two were an item. I feel that you, you even took them to meet your friends and family. How freaking embarrassing. I mean, it's not your fault. I don't want y'all to feel that way, Libra. But what I'm getting, like, I feel embarrassed for y'all. You know what I mean? Like, I'm on your side about how embarrassing. <sighs> you go to take this person to meet your family and friends, you know, and all the people you love and share that with them. And this person, it's like this person kept saying, yeah, we're going to be together or I want to be together. But they kept breadcrumbing and kept playing games with you. Maybe even they were supposed to meet your family and you told your family about this person and how much you love them. And all of a sudden this person like backs out. Oh, what the heck? Okay. Uh, the Wheel of Fortune is clarified by the world, the Six of Pentacles and the Hierophant. Yeah, you definitely started, you changed your mind about this person because you saw that this person was not serious. They didn't want what you wanted. All right. Um, you reached a turning point where you were done playing these games with this person and what they were doing. And you're no longer giving to the situation. You feel that um, you're ready to close this chapter. Like you waited long enough for this person and they never changed. They just kept doing the same crap over and over and over. And you're like, okay, I'm done. Yeah, you decided that you'd rather... Um, yeah, you kept trying to make this work with this person. You wanted things to move in a more positive direction, but you realized that you need to close the trap the chapter with them in order to receive the gifts that you are to receive. Like you, like you're, okay, this wheel of fortune. So you're supposed to receive whatever it is from the universe where um, it's going to be good luck good fortune okay but you had to close that chapter with this person in order to receive that and there was a lesson to be learned from this person and I feel like you learned that lesson like no I don't want to be with them yeah you definitely had a secret knowledge I feel like the high priestess you've become wiser okay you want somebody not only that you want somebody that matches your energy as far as um, the same wants and values you want marriage you don't want just some relationship that doesn't mean anything okay this person played you they just wanted to hold on to you string you along because they thought you were really good looking and they thought they feel like you will wait for them to make up their mind mm. clarify nine of pinnacles feel like yeah you learned a lesson in this you know there was a lesson to be learned and you did and right now you're more focused on yourself just, heck yeah you're deciding to walk away I like this, okay. You're being very independent. Queen of Cups, Five of Wands, Justice. There's times where you feel conflicted about um, giving this person another chance or just talking to them, okay? But 
for the most part, you got this, okay? You're healing, but at times, like I said, you feel like challenged, like, dang it, why do I keep thinking about them? But with the justice there, it's like you quickly are like, nope, uh, you know, remember this, remember what this person did, that's why you're not gonna be with them, remember how they were inconsistent, yeah. And yeah, you already know, okay, the Queen of Swords, like you're cutting this person out of your life, you're balancing out your life for yourself, you don't want somebody who's gonna be incons inconsistent, and you're not taking anybody back who's going to treat you like you're an option, no freaking way. Clarify the devil. This person tried to manipulate you and control you, I feel. I feel like they're a, a big manipulator. Oh, okay. You know what they do? Uh-huh. The devil's clarified by the hermit, the ace of cups, and the six of cups. This person wants you to chase after them. They feel that that's... I feel like this is their, their unhealthy... Um, behavior patterns where they always get what they want by disappearing on people um, to make that person fall in love with them just so they get their attention that's what they wanted they wanted just your attention they wanted all your love all your attention they wanted to keep you all to themselves but that didn't work in their favor it's like you wanted to hang out with friends and family and this person I forget that this person's actually jealous okay they didn't like all the attention that you get they also, they can't stop thinking about you. Like I said, I feel that this person, whenever they're kind of, they sit at home and they're like, man, they start to think about you, all the attention that you were giving them, the love they could have had with you. Um, and they're finally getting clarity, like in their mind, like, oh shit, I messed up with Libra. Yeah, you did. Clarify the Empress. See, they see you and that's, it's like this person spies on you is what I'm getting and they constantly are checking up on you. Um, you would know that it's kind of like a secret, but they want to know if you, because you're not talking to them, makes them like really drawn to you. Um, they feel that you just went away, didn't want anything to do with them. And now their feelings are, oh no, I love Libra. I want their attention. I want their time. They should have thought about that before they, I feel like this person needs to work on self-care and self-love. Like, I don't know. I feel like y'all are dealing with a narcissist. Let's just be honest. Okay. The Empress is clarified by the star, the Ace of Wands, and the Seven of Wands. Okay. Um, This person feel, okay, this person is a narcissist. Per, they're very narcissistic, okay? This person feels that they're very, how they feel about you. They feel that, yeah, you're very good looking. Um, they're hoping that whatever passion between, whatever it is that they got going on for themselves, they feel that that's what they have to use to get you back. Um, you wouldn't know that this person is really guarded not only that too um i even get like this person wants to love you they want to heal this connection through intimacy and um they want to be protective of you but that protectiveness that i'm getting i'm telling you it's like jealousy it's like they don't like the fact that you're getting attention from other this person drives by your house Clarify Seven of Pentacles. They feel that you're very guarded, though. Like, that you wouldn't give them the time or attention time of day. So why are they waiting? That's what I want to know. What are they waiting? Oh, they're, they're evaluating. They're really thinking about the way that they um, handled things with you. And that it, shoot, sorry, I broke a nail, yo. Um, Seven of Pentacles, clarified by Queen of Pentacles, Knight of Pentacles, and the Death card.
they want to come home. <laughs> That's what I see. This person's like, wait a minute, thinking about everything that they've been through as far as like um, thinking about the commitments that they had in their past and think about, you know, they're waiting for the right time. It looks like working on their money um, to show up and be more nurturing and like making a very bold move. I feel like this person's more focused on money. Like money is their thing right now. Um, possibly waiting till they have, like I said, this person in the beginning, they didn't have a lot to give. They, you wanted a relationship and they've been waiting to, um, you know, build their money up to be like, okay, I'm ready for that, to make that change with you. Um, can we try again? But I feel like you want to walk away. I feel like it's exhausting to you because it's so back and forth. All right, what's the outcome between Libra and their person? The outcome between Libra and their person. Eh, that's what I thought. Okay, y'all. Somebody's just in this for the game. The outcome is they're going to wait too long. You're going to be with somebody else probably. and Or they're going to come back acting like they change, but really they're going to put you in some kind of third-party situation or they want you to be more open to the idea of, I don't know why I'm getting that. I don't know why. I feel like this person's going to come back. It's like they're going to wait too long. And by the time they do, there's going to be a third-party situation because you're going to be with somebody and you're going to have to decide which person you want to be with. You're already going to be in another relationship with someone. I heard they're like the side piece now. Y'all, come on, Libra. You don't have to do that. As quickly as it starts, look at that. It's like if they come back, it's to get what they want too. Telling you that they've changed. Can we give this another try? And it's like you might, y'all might try. You might try and see how things go, but this person might have somebody or you might have somebody. But, and I feel like you might be meeting somebody online. Hmm. Y'all would know what you're doing more than I do. All right, let me get an Oracle card for Libra. I feel like they're gonna lose their opportunity. Like you're walking off to find happiness. And yeah, I feel like it's the happiness is gonna come. Oh shoot, for some of you, y'all are gonna be getting married and this person's gonna show up and try and like ruin everything because they don't want you to be with anybody else. So for those of you that have that coming up and you are with somebody, dating somebody now, if you have an ex that has been, because this ex is spying on you, okay? And they, this ex feels you walking away. They feel that you're like leaving. And that's what it is too. They don't, now they wanna fight for this because you're getting attention from somebody else. I'm telling you, you're dealing with a narcissist. I mean, y'all know that. <laughs> okay, nobility, the elk, nobility. Celebrate your accomplishments with humility. You are crowned with success. Powerful forces guide you. Your ability to conquer challenges are limitless. This is going to be a challenge um, because this person will come back and try and ruin things for you. Not only that, you might still have love for this person. However, you're in a new relationship or you're going to be in a new relationship. I don't know why this past person's coming up, but I want one more for you. Uh, lion, higher calling, okay? Um, you have within you all the courage you need. Let go of the past and reclaim your majesty. You will find success and contentment with those by your side. Make noble choices for your life and your tribe. Absolutely, because y'all are going to be getting married. You're going to be in a new relationship, um, possibly just dating. But the thing is, is this person's going to come back and try and ruin things. Don't allow that to happen, okay? Because they're, they're not changed. They're acting like, they feel like their money and what they have to offer is a change. And it's not. That's not love. So, I don't know, Libra. Y'all would know best. If this resonates, go ahead and hit the like button down below. And, I mean, like button. Go ahead and drop a comment down below. Hit the like button. I'll see you in your reading coming up this weekend. I'm going to be doing What Are They Hiding From You readings this weekend. So, have a good rest of your week. And I'll see y'all later. Bye.